hello everyone welcome back and today i'm here to share with you my recent purchases which i'm very excited about crafty goodies so first of all it's tim holtz media surface mat and i'm super excited about this one excuse the noise on the background my printer is working overtime um, it's printing papers for the album I'm making, photo album I'm making. So, super excited about this mat and I think I've been avoiding all the messy jobs uh, because I didn't want to uh, get my surface dirty, but now I have this mat. So, uh, it's gonna go on Tim Holtz glass mat. Super excited about this one. Can't wait to try it out. So, this is Tim Holtz media surface mat. Then, I got this little stump here. And I don't know if you can see that. Let's have a look. Uh, this is to make uh, swatches for inks can't remember where I got it now from uh, but it was really cheap um, like three or four pound or something so this is for swatching all your inks I thought it's really nice it has the writing negative positive so i will be doing that as well next i got a little mini stencil maple leaves and i thought this is gonna be absolutely perfect for the album i will be making autumn album and um, yeah it's gonna go perfect on there so something else i have in mind to make also replace replacement magnets so these are gonna go in my stamping platform excited about those you can never have too many magnets i also got faber castell pit artist pens in sanguine and i do like these this is the permanent ink and you have different uh, which love those I have quite few of those I also have got some stamens for flowers these are just white and I thought I will get white because I can always color them in so can't wait to use those as well I've got some circle punches and this is one inch five eighths and if I'm not mistaking three eighths of an inch this one I probably won't use but I got it uh, with an intention to use in my photo album and one inch is what I was looking for I actually wanted to get three quarters of an inch as well looking for that one where to get that one from so these i don't know i might use this one for something um i doubt it but you never know you never know next i got some embossing powders i had an impression but that's probably my own fault I had an impression that I'm getting WOW embossing powders and I thought I will get some sparkly ones, different colors specifically for uh, my photo album making and specifically for um, picture layouts so these are nice and sparkly and I've got some more. This 
green one, another blue one, another green one, and sandy color. So these specifically are going to be for my layouts, picture layouts and um, mini albums. They're going to go in there. Also got some different sizes. I think they're called cabochons. <laughs> cabochons. Um, yeah, so got those ones, different sizes. Excited to use those ones as well in my photo albums. So these are these. I also got myself a set of wooden rings. And these you probably can see being used in macrame. So these are different sizes. I didn't get them to use that way. I got them to make these little embellishments. And something like this, something like this to put um, in my photo albums. I think they're rather interesting. Different texture other than just paper. And obviously I have got some uh, threads in here. These are cotton and these are gonna go really well with the colors of my mini album. So doing those now and again and I think they look really nice and you do need this little guy for that so that's that I also got that's for mini album for photo album as well a little ribbon so this is gonna go in a photo album as well so yeah super excited about all that and thank you for watching again until next time bye